Hey guys, what's up? My name is Sean Russelt and welcome to my double programming series. So in this video we're going to be learning how to add up two numbers to each other. So basically, take one number and plus it with, a, with another number. So yes, let's begin by adding a spin edit component to the form. Let's just copy and paste it so we have two of them. Let's increase the font size to 16. Make it 20. Okay. Make it like. Let me just leave it where it was. I don't like it. Let's add a button to the form. Style 16. Button. Click to. Uh, just take me, guess. Add a label to the form, align it to the bottom, alignment center, output, change the font size to 20, 25, 25 is fine. Let's make it nice. I haven't really changed the color and stuff for a while now. Let's make the answer aqua and the body color to black or maybe mid gray. Oh no, black's fine. Okay, so there are actually two ways to add up numbers to each other. Um, you're going to be doing both ways and to add two variables. Um, the first number and the second number it's going to be integers. Um, this will also work with um, real types. So yes, spin head one dot value, spin head two, and so what are the two ways? Let's add another integer. Let's call this the answer. So right, answer. Let's add two buttons for both ways. Let's just leave one button. Maybe I give the give the same answer anyway. So yes, answer colon equals. Basically, it's really simple. Basically, we just take. The first value and plus it with the second value. It's really simple. So level one dot caption it's you to into str answer. So that's really simple. That's just how it works. So that will of course be zero, one or five plus fifteen would be twenty. Uh, 5 plus minus 15 would be minus 10 so it basically works as you guys see then, it, then there's a different way it just um, comment this way out this is the way I, way I this is the way I, way I ah, sorry this is the way I actually prefer doing it um, it's called the sum function so it's being underlined because it doesn't exist basically we have to add it with the math uses laws here so we just so, so just go there and add math to the top so that it works basically we have to add that that little bracket state and then just in one comma in two and then it gives it returns a floating value which is an real so I'll say float to str oh no sorry my mistake there's a problem though I can't remember how to convert um and floating value to an integer anyway we can just do it like this float to str see that we have learned the stuff you can, you can convert it to a string 
and then we can, we can convert it from a string to a int. Boom! That's how we roll. So yes, that will also work. Um, so you can do it this way. Let's add uh, with that number and that number. So you guys can see that that works. That's something simple as you guys can see it works. So yes. Um, let's change the code a bit. Uh, let's remove this answer one. To just display directly from here. As you can also see clearly how it looks it works. Uh, yep. So it's basically it's just how to add numbers to each other. So yep thanks for watching guys uh please make sure to like comment subscribe and share and i'll see you in the next video the next video will probably um talk about how hmm, i think the next video will talk about how to minus numbers with each other and also how to multiply and divide boom yes so thanks for watching. Bye!